Hey there, what's up everyone? I got the MacBook Pro 2020 with the M1 chip and in this video I'm gonna be unboxing it and reviewing it for you guys. Let's go. What's up? Welcome back to another video. Sergio here with Surge Tech. In this channel, I do a lot of tech reviews and tutorials. So if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe and hit the bell so that you get notified on future videos like this. So before I begin the video, go ahead and hit that like button as it helps the video out with the YouTube algorithm. And let's jump right into the video now. So here we have it, MacBook Pro M1. So small box here for a MacBook Pro. Well, this is a 13.3 inch. And as you can see here on the back, this is the eight gigabyte memory memory model with 256 gigabytes of SSD flash storage. So let's go ahead and open it up. And there we have it. So I can already feel it's a pretty heavy laptop for its size. The screen is only 13.3 inches, but it's definitely packed with a lot of technology in there because it is definitely heavy for the size. So let's see what else comes with here. We have the standard to all new MacBooks, USB type C cable on both ends. And here it looks like we're gonna have the manual here and startup guide and your Apple sticker right here. Here we have your fast charger for your MacBook Pro. And uh, as you can see this right here, is usually it has a metal ring around it yeah here this charger is from my 2018 macbook pro and uh, as you can see we put it here against the 2020 macbook pro you can also tell that it's a little bit smaller just by a tiny bit this one has a chrome ring around the charging port and this one has a white ring around it so this is a 61 watt usb-c power adapter for fast charging although taking a look here at my 2018 macbook pro charger it's an 87 watt charger so i would assume that this one charges the MacBook a lot faster. But then again, my 2018 MacBook Pro is a 15 inch, not a 13.3 inch like the 2021. So that's pretty much it. Let's go ahead and move this to the side. So here we have the MacBook Pro. Let's go ahead and remove this. So here we have it. Let's take a look at the MacBook real quick. So on this side, we're gonna have two USB-C. And then on this side, all we're gonna have is just this 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. And then over here on the front, we're just gonna have the slide opening here to open up the screen of the laptop. And then at the top, it's just gonna be plain, just the uh, hinges here to open and close the screen. Then here on the bottom, we're gonna have the four rubber pad so that your MacBook Pro can stand. And that's pretty much it. Apple logo here at the top. So let's go ahead and get it set up. So the main thing about the new 2020 MacBook Pro is obviously the new M1 chip. So Apple's gonna be manufacturing their own processors for their MacBooks from now on. And the M1 chip is supposed to be two to three times faster than the previous processor chips on MacBooks. So it's an eight core CPU with four performance cores and four efficiency cores for speed and a longer lasting battery. However, in the next video, I am gonna be doing speed tests with the new Apple MacBook M1 chips against previous year MacBook Pros with fast processors processors as well so that we can compare the speed difference and see if it's actually faster in real life. So the MacBook Pro comes with a 13.3 inch screen and it comes with an LED backlit display with IPS technology with 2560 by 1600 resolution. It comes with eight gigabytes of memory RAM, configurable up to 16 gigabytes and 256 gigabytes of SSD flash storage, configurable from 512 gigabytes, one terabyte or even up to two gigabyte flash storage. So the battery on the new MacBook Pros with the M1 chip is supposed to last longer, so it's supposed to have a use time of up to 17 hours while browsing the web and up to 20 hours while using Apple TV app movie playback. It has a built-in 58.2 watt hour lithium polymer battery, and the power adapter is a 61 watt fast charging USB-C power adapter. It comes with two Thunderbolt ports, also known as USB 4, for all your connections and to charge the MacBook Pro. It has the touch bar, touch ID, an ambient light sensor sensor and the force touch trackpad. It has a 720p FaceTime HD camera and it now comes with a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and it comes with the newest Mac OS, Mac OS Big Sur. All right everyone, so that was just the unboxing and quick review of the Apple MacBook Pro 2020 with the M1 processor. So stay tuned for future videos where I'm gonna be doing speed and battery tests to compare the actual speed and battery lifespan of the new MacBook Pros. So stay tuned for that. And that's it for this video everyone. Go ahead and give it a like if you enjoyed it and I'll catch you guys in the next one. And as always, peace.